Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over how to create an About Me whiteboard video in Doodly. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. What is an About Me video? It's a short video that you upload to YouTube, LinkedIn, or another site, or even link it in your email signature if you'd like, where you talk about yourself and your business. The most common use for these videos is to introduce yourself and provide information about what you do. The first thing you want to think about is what you're going to include. Now, it's going to depend, are you promoting yourself or the business? In this example, we're promoting Amanda Jones. You know, maybe she's doing a job search or maybe she wants to warm up her clients before they have a meeting over the phone or in person. So she wants to just give them a little background. So in this case, obviously, she's going to include her name and title and what she does, how she helps her customers, what services does she specialize in. If it's more about the company, maybe she's a founder of the company. So in that case, she might offer a brief background about why she founded it and what her core values are for the business, its mission, and so forth. In either case, you do want to include what problems you help solve for your clients and give them a reason. Why should they work with you? And then finally, include a call to action, such as a link where people can find out more about you or contact you. You might also want to include your social media links like Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, and so forth. So I've already created my script. It's going to be short and sweet. It's going to be a maximum of four scenes, including the call to action. I have my script in hand. It's going to say, my name is Amanda. I'm a web developer, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to go down here to the microphone track and click this little plus sign. Now I have a red microphone. When I push that, I can start recording. So here we go. My name's Amanda. I'm a web developer. That means every day I help people communicate ideas and tell stories online. Okay, so I clicked the red button to stop it. And you'll see it's a, it needs to be adjusted a little. The beginning here, if I put my little mouse over here and I have two arrows, I can slide it over and then I can drag the track over and I think that will be good. And I imagine I'll have to fine tune it, but for now I'm just going to go ahead and add scene settings, extra time at the end because I just do that anyway as, as a best practice. And I'm going to make it two seconds and I'm going to click apply. And that's looking pretty good. I'm not worried about timing right now. I'm focusing on the audio. So I'm going to move on and click the plus sign here just to add a blank scene. It's just a placeholder. Click the plus sign and click the red one when you're ready. Here we go. What does that mean for you? It could be anything from building an e-commerce site to designing your new website or social media marketing campaign. I take your concept and turn it into a reality. I don't know if you heard that, but my dog <laughs> snored right as I was getting ready to do my voiceover. So here it is. This is my dog snoring. And obviously I don't want that. So I'm just going to go ahead and close that up. And then we're just going to move this over and that should be fine. So now she's a web developer. So we're going to go over to props and we're going to find a computer, computer monitor, I think would be fine. Let's do this desktop. Let's see, e-commerce. Once you know your character's name, you can just type it in and only see images of that character. And that's oftentimes handy. And just because it says she's a stockbroker doesn't mean she can't be a web developer. Okay, and that looks nice. Now, you'll notice here, the audio is much shorter than the length of the scene by default. And that's perfectly fine because we're gonna change this. We certainly don't wanna spend three seconds drawing a monitor. So I'm going to make that maybe one second. And we're looking really good. I do want scene settings, extra time at the end here, two seconds. And that's pretty darn close. You'll see we are a little long here on the first one. 
gonna go for one second at the end and now they're lined up perfectly okay and that looks good I'm gonna move on to the next one and on this one we're talking about Acme development when she founded it in 2006 so I'm just gonna do something a little different here and then maybe you have a little logo that you want to add I don't have a logo prepared but you could do that if you'd like and we want to look at the timing again so my audio ends over here and my scenes over here so I actually this time need to add a little time so let's look web development needs to come first and then the year and then the lady and I don't know that we want to spend three seconds drawing her so I'm gonna make that two and then we'll add the time at the end so we're going to make that up 2.5 seconds. And you'll see it ends kind of right there where the voice ends here. And we can just move our audio over and we're ready now for the call to action. Now again, you can copy and paste some of your original things. So I'm going to use the same scene. I'm just going to duplicate it. Right click, duplicate. And then I'm going to drag it over to the very end. I can delete my blank scene now. And then we go over here. We don't need the about me anymore. That's our beginning title. So we can change that to contact me or connect with me, I think is the wording that she used. So we're going to say connect with me. And then we're going to add our contact information and then at the end we're gonna want this scene to stay on for longer than one second because we want people to have a chance to write down these numbers and web addresses so let's put 10 seconds and click apply and then finally you can think about adding music if you'd like and you would just go over here to sounds categories music and then find a nice soundtrack that you'd like to add. I'll just use this one so you can see how to do it. You just drag it in and then you're gonna want to click this little speaker icon and turn the music way down. It's gonna be super loud and drown out your voiceover if you don't. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm down at 14% and I think that should be fine. And then we want to adjust it because that was what, 44 seconds long? And in this case, this this music is about the right length. It's, it's fine. It ends a little earlier than my video does. We can always shorten it if we'd like to. And I'm just gonna do a quick preview and we'll be done. My name's Amanda. I'm a web developer. That means every day I help people communicate ideas and tell stories online. What does that mean for you? It could be anything from building an e-commerce site to designing your new website or social media marketing campaign. I take your concept and turn it into a reality. I founded Acme Web Development in 2006 and I love what I do. Our mission is to make your online dreams come true. I'd love to find out more about your plans. Together, we can make them a reality. Here's how we can connect. And there you have it, a quick about me video made in Doodly. Thanks for watching.